Hello viewers, most of you know me, and for those that don't, I'm Nolan Cobb, and um, I'm going to use this to shoot down rumors and false predictions about me, to set things back to normal. It all started... Everything used to be normal with my three best friends, Connor, Aaron, and Richie, Richard. But now, they're completely different people. I'm trying to decide how to start this story. I think it started about a couple of weeks ago. Well, I guess we should have seen this coming when Mr. Green asks for a favor. Is that one of the school's books? No, it would have one of the tabs on it. What is it? It's called the Geibel. What is it? Hmm. This book is a how-to guide on how to get girls and be popular. No way. Well, maybe it is. Looks like it was written by a couple of guys that have already graduated. This book, it can... Get us girlfriends? Make us popular? Nolan, you can finally use this book to ask out Ashley. I don't know, man. For all we know, this book could be full of BS. Oh, well, let's do a test run. Yes. Yes. I don't know, man. There's just something Oh, uh, not... let's try the cafe. There are a lot of girls there to test to see if this book works. Oh, well, let's go. You coming, Nolan? I'm coming. Only to watch you guys fail. All right, let's go. Right after we uh, finish putting up these books. Now looking back on it, I should have just left that book in the media center. I didn't know at the time that things would eventually turn to hell. Over the next couple of days, the boys used the book like crazy. They got a whole bunch of girls' numbers, and I just sat on the side scolding them. I didn't have any words at the moment. Into the show. Yeah, it's probably one of my favorite TV shows. You think maybe you'd like to come over and we could watch it together, maybe? Oh, uh, what? Oh yeah, that would uh, that'd be great. Is something wrong? No, it's it's just I'm trying to remember if I have homework. Oh. No, you see, what I actually wanted to ask you is if you wanted to be my, yeah. my TV watching buddy. Yeah, sure. Okay. Probably not the smoothest thing to just flat out kiss her. But sometimes you gotta seize the day, I guess. Okay, I'll admit. Ashley was my first girlfriend, so I had no idea what I was doing. I had no idea how to be a good boyfriend. I spent a lot of time with Ashley. I tried to make time for my friends, but I could never find them. I probably should have noticed that as when the book started to change then. I wanted nothing to do with that book to help me with Ashley. Our relationship was great. The best couple of weeks of my high school life, actually. But that happiness went away when the book came back. Hey, there he is. Yo, Nolan, where have you been? We haven't seen you in weeks. Hey guys, where have you guys been the last couple of weeks? We hear that you and Ashley are a couple now. Is that true? Yeah, we're a couple. Well, that's awesome. Now you can start using this thing. I thought I told you I wasn't going to use this thing. But it works. 
You won't believe how many girls we've been able to get with. You know, uh, there's this party coming up. You and Ashley should come. Where is it? Oh. Uh, well, here's the address. If you come, great. If you don't, too bad. It'll be a good time either way. You and Ashley should come. Come on, you guys. I guess I have to talk about this part now, don't I? I want to apologize to Ashley. I didn't mean for any of that stuff that went down at the party to happen. I didn't want it to. The party seemed like a fun idea to bring her along, but... Richard, that guy looks just like you. I like techno and psychedelic music, hey! What are you talking about? It looks nothing like me. Okay, I'm gonna go through this very fast because I don't like talking about it. But basically, at the party, all, all these guys started lifting us up and calling me and my friends players. The players of high school. Ashley, of course, overheard this and assumed I was just using her. She ran out the house and I ran out right after her. But she didn't want anything to do with me. That's when I realized I had to do something about this whole thing. Well, now you're all up to date, I guess. I just wish things would go back to normal. Back to how they used to be. I want to prove a point that no stupid book can get a girl to fall in love with you or whatever. I never used that book, and I never wanted to. And I wish Ashley could see that and give me a second chance. I wanted her to like me for, for well, me. But at least now I can set things straight. That was Ashley. I think things are going to be all right. Now, I know some of you are going to want to get your hands on this, but it's not going to happen. I'm going to burn it. If I've learned anything from this book, it's that Women aren't objects. They're human beings with thoughts and emotions. And they're not just something for guys to trick and mess around with. Well, now you know the story. I guess that's it.